Welcome to another day in Minecraft. We are looking over this beautiful container ship containing villages, but today we will focus on something different. On this side of the ship I plan to have an uh, uh, industrial harbor area and uh, one build that goes in here is the uh, iron farm which I started over there. So this farm is based on the design by uh, Technoman88 and uh, DocM77 so I will link those tutorials and the tricky part is basically uh, you can build this all uh, uh, quite easily it's not that complicated um, even if the tutorial is in uh, creative world but the tricky part is uh, actually to get zombie in the in the cauldron or the uh, villagers uh, in their cells and the trick to do that um, I learned this from uh, from another YouTuber. I'm not quite sure of the name yet, uh, but I will link it. So trick is to uh, basically build a platform uh, over the spot where uh, the uh, actual entity should end up, and then have a rail moving up to that spot uh, carting the entity over here and then basically remove the cart and uh, remove that block entity falls down and in place so with the uh, villages that's uh, pretty straightforward uh, with the uh, zombie it's a bit more difficult because uh, you have to uh, push it in the cauldron you have to make sure that it doesn't escape you can do that with uh, half slabs uh, around here and uh, then you basically uh, uh, take, a, take a shield and uh, uh, shove the uh, zombie into the cauldron and place a trap door or half slab above it so uh, it cannot escape then you can remove the uh, half slab around it but uh, let's see how this uh, actually works uh, with uh, putting another villager in there uh, each cell needs three of them so uh, Let's get going. As we have stored our villages over here and uh, don't actually need to uh, convert them uh, to uh, zombie villages and heal them up for the uh, farm purpose, I just redirected uh, the, uh, the uh, line here so we can uh, cart them off uh, directly here and onto the main line um, so we don't waste any uh, good potions or uh, golden apples on those especially since I uh, already wasted a few uh, uh, villages in the process uh, uh, figuring all the uh, details out how to get them in in the best way and uh, also you have to be uh, uh, careful because uh, when they uh, sleep in their beds and get up they have to end up on uh, on this block so uh, uh, you have to have radius uh, around the beds uh, uh, so they do not pop out onto the wrong block. Uh, 
so let's do that and re remove the uh, minecart this one and this block and he drops down and is now in there so we can uh, fetch it once again but need to remove those blocks just to make sure that they do not spawn on them and we have what have we we have a Fletcher and probably a farmer so let's build this up again uh, this block in this block out and yep so now we can uh, uh, fetch the uh, next one so bit of progress report i did uh, this cell first but as you can see it's empty now that's uh, did not quite work out as uh, intended if you remember correctly we have uh, this workstation one block lower as in uh, docam's uh, design i moved it up uh, primarily the uh, issue that i had here is with uh, i had three villages in there but only two took up the uh, a job from the uh, workstation the third one did not seem to pathfind to his workstation no idea why but nevertheless it did produce uh, iron uh, golems and uh, as you can see i was slain by one uh, when trying to uh, kill them off so they hit pretty hard so uh, tried to kill him with uh, with a swor sword no good idea um, it's uh, it's better to do it with uh, with bow and arrow so then i went over over here and this seems to work we have three villages in here a farmer a toolsmith and a fletcher and i should have picked up Minecarts, nope. Apparently they uh, do spawn, so let's get out of here and do the second cell. And so I will see you soon with the next update. Okay, we are one step further. We have both cells uh, populated. This one with uh, three villages, and I think all of them have taken a job. And over there, we have three more villages. And I also uh, started to dig out the uh, perimeter that we need. Uh, eight blocks on this side, eight on the other eight in this direction and then eight down so same on this side and on the uh, outside we can see it goes down to uh, this level and there we will have uh, a water stream uh, that pushes the uh, the iron golems into uh, lava 
uh, with hoppus beneath. But something happened. You remember there in the middle in the cauldron there was something. It's gone. Obviously it's uh, a rare occurrence but uh, s uh, still an open uh, Minecraft bug. Open since uh, uh, 2012 I think and um, still no solution found there. Uh, we have named him and he was even holding uh, a track so uh, there is no way he should have this spawn so uh, we will have to work get another uh, zombie in there then digging out uh, the rest of this uh, setting up the uh, item collection and the uh, killing and then we should be good function wise uh, what's remaining to do is uh, designing uh, building around it but that comes later on so we are in the night shooting down skellies uh, but I'm actually out here to catch me a new zombie Hello, there are quite a bunch, uh, especially we are interested in zombies that can uh, hold something uh, and I want to hold them some dirt. So uh, is this large mob we have to kill off all the rest and try not hitting the ones uh, holding the dirt. So we uh, do a bit of a dance around and uh, with this large mob you can see they uh, they do quite a bit of damage to me. So uh, while trying to kill the uh, others off, not hitting uh, the ones with uh, the uh, dirt and not dying. So maybe eat a bite in between to heal up. Uh, it's it's quite a bit of a challenge but there are only a few remaining so take another bite and yes let's hop, hop over the track that should get one of them in so this is the setup around the cauldron nicely put in with uh, uh, dirt or some other block and up here half slabs around the block I need to mine out and that's actually the block uh, where the uh, zombie is currently sitting on in his uh, minecart mine chilling so let's put a block here then get rid of uh, that one get rid of the uh, minecart uh, mine that block out and he is down there so we can uh, close this in again and then we need our shield yeah you can see he's not standing in the corner so we need to uh, push him so let's crouch and push him a bit and he is in and now we can place uh, another half slab up here and we can remove the rest so we can stand up and uh, for now uh, let's just uh, put on uh, some uh, dirt to the side here to block the uh, view of the uh, villages so we don't have uh, golem spawn constantly 
I have not yet named this guy uh, because I have not the uh, proper name for him. Yes, you're excited. He will get named. Don't you worry. But all in good time. So, the uh, hour of truth. Uh, yeah, I still have some dirt. So, as this guy is holding some dirt, we named him uh, Harry. So, now let's uh, remove the dirt on those sides. And this dirt. And uh, let's see if this uh, actually uh, works. Uh, so in order to work there have to be four villages within a certain radius. The villages need to have slept, they need to have profession and then they need to gossip at least five times uh, about the need for a golem and then one golem should spawn up there hopefully uh, but as it is night uh, the villagers are uh, scared um, but they don't have worked yet, so uh, let's wait for the morning. And another day, another morning. So soon we should see if this is uh, this is working. We can switch on the uh, hit boxes, so we can uh, see the. Uh, area where they are looking, what direction they are looking. So hopefully we don't have to work too long. At the beginning of the day they do not work, so it might take a while for the first column to spawn. But let's keep our fingers crossed and let's hope they uh, end up down there in the pit and that they are actually uh, pushed in uh, that corner there. Yes. Okay. I thought that might be a problem because I think if the uh, if it would be one smaller it would work but even with the uh, column uh, down there uh, another one should spawn because uh, that one is out of range for the uh, villages to detect. At least that's what I understood. What happens if we kill that one? Do we get a new one? If we do get the new one, then we are too high up there. Oh, maybe I have to account for the head of the golem and not uh, the block uh, where he's standing on. So um, that would be uh, three blocks deeper. Yeah. Looks like uh, that might be an issue, and that might be another one. 
So back to the drawing board, but at least uh, it is somewhat working. So I fixed the farm, at least uh, temporary, uh, by basically uh, moving the uh, source blocks a bit around. So uh, instead of uh, here in the uh, corners, I moved it uh, one step in, and uh, with one here, one in that corner, one in that corner. Uh, this basically covers the whole floor and then I have one here uh, just so uh, to avoid uh, golems being uh, pushed here into the middle so that they get pushed into that corner. Uh, at the moment uh, it seems like only this cell is spawning golems and they only spawn a new one once the uh, old one is killed up down here so and there is another one but uh, uh, i think the uh, spawn rates uh, are uh, already quite uh, good at least uh, better than um, what we had uh, for uh, the uh, 12 version where we had a chance I don't know one golem every uh, every five minutes and uh, we should soon see another golem spawn up there and uh, maybe we can uh, get uh, golem spawning from uh, both cells yes and there is another one so I think this is this is quite great. This should cover our uh, needs for the uh, for the iron, at least in the uh, short term. And I'm sure I will come back to this project, finishing up the uh, building around it, and maybe also lowering uh, this down further so that the uh, golems that are down here are not detected from uh, up there so they can uh, spawn and uh, hopefully also figuring out uh, uh, a way that they can be spawned by both cells okay. however this one well I'm not quite sure this one came down this side so might be spawned by uh, this one but we only know for sure if the cells have synchronized and we get two golem spawns at the same time okay the uh, villages started to work again but um, apparently they do not want to sync or oh, uh, only one cell is producing golems but I will leave that problem for another day because just uh, standing uh, the night through here uh, got us quite a bit of uh, iron already so let's fill this up and uh, we should have soon enough iron to craft the yeah, iron blocks that we would need to uh, construct a beacon so then we only need the beacon itself but that's also for another time thank you for watching and see you in the next video